Here we are, Barb. Evans Cemetery. Just where mom wanted dad to be buried. 150 miles away from the nearest glass of beer. Mother wants him to be remembered, so every year we drive three hours into the country to put overpriced flowers on his grave while she sits comfortably at home. I think we either need to move mother out here or move the grave to Boston. Now let's get this over with. I'm nursing a hangover with the time change. It's already starting to get dark. And I don't think I'll even have the radio to keep me awake at the wheel. It seemed to cut out the last few miles. I don't know what's wrong with it. We still remember. I don't. You know, in fact, I don't even remember what he looks like. But you know what I do remember? How scared you used to be in the cemetery. Remember how I used to dare you to knock on the doors of the mausoleum to see if anyone was home? Remember how scared you'd get? Remember that one time I hid behind that tree over there and jumped out and scared you? And Grandpa got so excited. He starts shaking his fist at me saying, boy, you be damned to hell. Actually, I think you're still afraid. They're coming to get you, Barbara. They're rising from their graves. They're going to get you. Oh, look, the dead, they rise. Here comes one now. That's no mourner. That's a ghoul. I'm getting out of here. 